guys! Welcome back to The Vaunt with Dana and welcome back to our Beauty in the Bathroom series. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited to get to dive right into this because this is an amazing product that I'm about to share with you. And just to give a little disclaimer, we're not talking about makeup and we're not talking about lotions or food. That's that's for later. I want to save that for you. But today we're going to be talking about soap. And it's from dun, 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 Ancient Bath and Beauty. Yes, indeed. This is from Ancient Bath and Beauty. And this is a lip balm, which I have on. Can you see? And as you can tell, I have on no makeup, which is a good thing because sometimes you may not always want to get done up. So this is candid. So we're having a nude day. Not, you know, not in physical sense, but just in the upper sense, you know, just a new day, a nude day with we're being nude with our feelings. We're just being open and willing to, you know, try something new. So that's what we're doing today. So since I have this hot leather tube in my hand here, okay, let's give a little description of what this is, shall we? Okay. This is an organic coconut milk and peach lip balm. Can you see the label? Organic coconut milk peach and lip balm. Okay, so the ingredients is organic extra virgin coconut oil, organic non GMO avocado oil, organic cocoa butter, jojoba oil, vitamin E oil, natural beeswax, organic flavor oil, stevia. So this is amazing. And I just started using it yesterday. So this is how it looks, you see? If you can see it, maybe if you can. I mean, but that's really how the color is. It's like white. Can you see? Mm. And especially since the weather is dry, lip balms and all things lip care has definitely been my safe haven and my saving grace. So it's my lips, especially in this weather, even though it's springtime, hey, it's so dry, the pollination is horrible, so definitely beeping up your immune system is essential. And we're going to talk about that on the cooking channel, Kal Tofu for Breakfast, where we're going to cook different meals vegan-based, since I'm a vegan, and we're going to be making natural remedies to cure a common cold and to prevent it, and beauty treatments too. So I'll leave that to you when you come on. So, let's move on, shall we? <laughs> I get carried away, crack myself up. Okay, this, my friend, is a lemongrass soap. And it may seem small, but I actually cut it in half. And the full size was about this tall. And it was like a wide soap, like a square shaped. And I have the photo of the packaging of the soap on my blog, danadavis.com, and I'll leave everything in the description box along with the link to get your own soap. Go on that shop, yes indeed. So, this is amazing, and it smells like organic lemongrass, and it doesn't smell offensive, you know, because I've tried dozens of soaps, as you may know from now, that certain products irritate me, and it doesn't, and it, and it wipes me out, and it, wipe, and it wipes away all of the pH balance that I need to protect myself from infections and this weather and everything. So definitely getting a soap that is that doesn't dry out your skin still allows you to have your natural body oils, that's good. And a soap that puts back into you is amazing. And as you can see my face, it feels very clean. And as I told you, no makeup. So I use this on my face in the shower and this is amazing. As you can see, I love things that smell. So this soap is amazing. And I have another half that I really want to save for later. And that's how potent this soap is. You see, I cut it in half. And look at this. It's very thick. So that means that this is going to last me for quite some time. And that's essential. Because when you buy a bar of soap, you don't want it to last only two weeks. This looks like it can last me about maybe three and a half. You know what I'm saying? So definitely consider that in the soaps that you buy because bar soaps shouldn't be too expensive, but considering if you're getting the name brand ones, it will be. But this lemongrass soap is not name brand and it's organic and it's 
and it's very cost effective you know it's affordable so make sure that you get that and just have a ball with it so i'll see you again on levant with dana follow me on instagram true levant and twitter at true levant so keep coming back subscribe in that red little box and i can't wait to hear from you guys and your comments so keep flying keep soaring keep living god bless Yeah. <laughs>